Most people love dogs. How can you not? They're just so cute. But some are unique, to say the least. Some will never be Instagram famous. Or if they are, it's for all the wrong reasons. These are the 20 most unusual dogs in the world. Number 20. Green Puppies Dogs come in all shapes, sizes, and colors. Even in a single litter, it's not uncommon to have a mixture of different colors that can be pretty shocking to see. But imagine your dog giving birth to a litter of puppies and noticing that one of them is green. It sounds absurd, but it actually happens on the odd occasion. There was one example of it in 2019 in Vermelskirchen, northern Germany. Joanna Justice's golden retriever gave birth to eight golden puppies and one green one. It stood out next to its siblings, and they named it Mojito. Joanna was worried about why the puppy was green, but said they were all doing well. According to vets, green fur is rare, but it can be caused by boliverdin, the bile pigment found in dogs' placentas. When puppies are born, the boliverdin dislodges and mixes with amniotic fluid in the mother's womb, staining the puppy's fur. Eventually, the fur grows out and goes back to its natural color. The puppies are usually otherwise healthy. Another dog was born in the same year with a green coat in Colorado. A Great Dane birthed nine black and white puppies, and one had a greenish tint that made it stand out from the others. Like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now, or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Now, it's time for the odd topic. This family adopted a new dog, but when the vet saw it, he called the cops. As you can see in this photo, this poor puppy was covered in ticks. The vet was so shocked, he rang the cops, worried it was the result of the owners mistreating the dog. Thankfully, not only was the vet able to save the dog, but after the police investigated the situation, they were able to see that the dog was much loved by his owners, and they were not responsible for the ticks. They had actually only just adopted him, and it was the previous owners who had been the problem. As always, let us know your thoughts in the comments section down below using the hashtag oddtopic. Number 19. Zeus, the tallest dog in the world. How many people can say they have the tallest dog in the world? Just one, Brittany Davis from Texas. In 2022, Guinness World Records confirmed that her American Great Dane, Zeus, was the tallest dog at 3 feet 5.18 inches. According to Brittany, Zeus was the biggest puppy in a litter of five from a Merle Sire and Brindle Dam, and that proved to be a sign of things to come. In true Clifford the Big Red Dog style, Zeus didn't stop growing, and the two-year-old puppy towers above all other dogs. Dogs. While he could let his fame go to his head, Zeus lives a fairly ordinary life with Brittany, three miniature Australian shepherds, and a cat. He goes on leisurely strolls around the neighborhood, wanders the local farmer's markets, and sleeps by the window in their home. The gentle giant is scared of the rain and also has a cheeky streak by swiping food left on counters. Well, let's face it, it's a bit hard trying to keep food out of reach of something as tall as Zeus is. When he's not swiping the odd snack, he's getting his energy from 12 cups of large breed dog food daily, along with treats like bully sticks, the occasional fried egg, and ice cubes. Number 18. Yuki the Giant Wolf Dog the world would have never gotten a chance to learn about Yuki if it weren't for the HBO TV series Game of Thrones. Yuki was a wolf dog that looked like a wolf from the TV show and was saved from a kill shelter by Shy Wolf Sanctuary. Yuki was taken to the shelter at eight months old when his owner became sick, and the puppy was too much for them to handle. While it was likely that Yuki would have been euthanized, Shy Wolf Sanctuary took him in and had been caring for him since 2008. They released photos of him online showing his huge size, and they went viral, skyrocketing him and the sanctuary to fame. In 2018, the sanctuary undertook a DNA test of the enormous dog to determine just how much of a wolf he really was. It turns out that Yuki was 87.5% gray wolf, 8.6% Siberian husky, and 3.9% German shepherd. So yeah, not exactly your standard easy-to-train domestic dog. At 10 years old, Yuki was diagnosed with a blood cancer called hemangiosarcoma, and they were told he would be crossing over the Rainbow Bridge soon. However, after providing him with an immune supplement, he lived comfortably for another three years before passing away on his own terms at age 13 in 2020. Number 17. Crazy, the Usain Bolt of the dog world. 
Crazy the Border Collie truly lives up to her name. The six-year-old dog is an agility champion and international jumping champion, and she's so quick that you'd almost get dizzy watching her navigate an agility course. She is absolutely crazy. Crazy and her owner, Ewan Patterson, have worked hard to get crazy to the level she's at today, and Yuan believes that she's probably faster than Usain Bolt. He also said she's an incredibly focused dog who's full of drive, determination, and energy. However, he also said that she's a sweet dog who loves to be calm, relaxed, and cuddly when she's in the house. She's basically the best of both worlds. Ewan knew that she was something special as a puppy when, at eight weeks old, she leaped out of her puppy pen to explore the home. Since then, Ewan has been working with Crazy to help her reach her full potential, and he treats her like an athlete. She enjoys a diet of raw meat and vegetables, undertakes regular hydrotherapy and physiotherapy sessions, and takes a range of supplements to support her health and well-being. Ewan said Crazy and his three other dogs have their own room in their house with couches and chairs to relax on, and they all enjoy an hour-long walk before a single 15-minute training session with Crazy gets underway. Number 16. Juji, the 450-pound dog Juji, the 450-pound dog, is proof that you can't trust everything you see, read, and hear on the internet. Juji is described as a 450-pound dog, but that doesn't mean he is. The alleged 10-foot-tall golden doodle is actually your standard size, but that's not what his owner, Chris Klein, would have you believe. Chris has been taking photos of Juji and editing them to make him look enormous. Now, initially, the images were a bit of fun between Chris and his girlfriend, Christine Fagerly, but they ended up going viral. As an April Fool's joke, the dodo posted photoshopped images with help from Chris, and people fell for the joke hook, line, and sinker. And even when he claimed that Juji weighed 450 pounds, there were still a few people who were in awe of this huge dog. And to be honest, when you see the photos, most of them look pretty realistic. You can see Chris sitting on the dog in a library reading a book, and Juji sitting on the sofa with Chris, making him look tiny in comparison. Before long, Chris's Instagram profile with pictures of Juji amassed hundreds of thousands of followers, with people eager to learn more about this giant giant dog. How disappointed do you think they were when they realized he was just a regular-sized golden doodle? Number 15. Maggie, the oldest dog in the world. While Maggie the Kelpie's age couldn't be verified due to her paperwork being lost when she was a puppy, farmer Brian McLaren's 34-year-old son was just four years old when Maggie joined their family. At 30 years old, that would make her the world's oldest dog. Maggie was more than living her best life with Brian on a dairy farm in Victoria, Australia. Brian said she would spend half the day sleeping and half the day wandering from the dairy to the office. Toward the end of her life, Brian would often check on her when she was asleep just to make sure she was still alive. Aside from having age-related slowness and being deaf, she was otherwise healthy and hadn't received any veterinary care for the last 15 years of her life. Sadly, Maggie passed away at the ripe old age of 30, which would be around 133 in human years. According to Brian, she went to sleep in her basket and never woke up again. Brian said she was still doing well the week before, but started going downhill in two days before eventually passing on her own terms. Brian said he was sad but was pleased with how she passed, and he buried her under a pine tree on the property. Number 14. Jesse, the most helpful dog. Taking care of daily errands can be hard work. Sometimes you just wish someone would take care of everything for you, like loading the dishwasher, turning on a pot of coffee, and even helping you take your socks off after a hard day of work. But you don't actually need a butler or helpful relative, you just need Jesse the Jack Russell. Jesse is a super intelligent dog with a passion for learning. Ever since he was a puppy, he would pick up tricks incredibly quickly and would be eager to learn more. By the time he reached his senior years, he could perform at least 400 different tricks, from something as simple as retrieving the morning paper to tasks as complicated as loading the dishwasher, riding a scooter, and rocking on a rocking horse. Heather Brooke had always wanted her own dog and fell in love with the Jack Russell breed. When she was 16, her parents surprised her with a Jack Russell puppy they adopted. By the time he was nine weeks old, he had already taught himself how to sit up to get attention, and she knew he was something special. Heather used food and clicker training to teach him a wide range of things from that moment on. It even got to the point where she ran out of ideas and had to turn to YouTube for inspiration. This quick-learning little fella truly is something special. Number 13. Hong Dong, the most expensive dog in the world. 
After a trip to the vet for a medical emergency, you might describe your four-legged friend as the most expensive dog in the world. But they'll have nothing on the red Tibetan Mastiff, Hong Dong, who was purchased for 10 million yuan, or over 1.5 million dollars. Hong Dong sure is a gorgeous dog. When his owner, a coal baron from the north of China, purchased him at 11 months old, he weighed 178 pounds and was an adorable ball of fluffy red hair. But as you might imagine, having soft, snuggly fur doesn't make a dog worth over one and a half million dollars. So why the hefty price tag? Well, for many reasons. His breeder, Lu Liang, said Hong Dong, which means big splash, is the perfect specimen. He said they spent a lot of money on the dog and also have staff salaries to pay. Plus, this dog doesn't need a regular dry biscuit and dog roll diet. Instead, he is known to feast on abalone, sea cucumber, chicken, and beef. Lu Liang was just as shocked by how much the owner was willing to pay, but he says he has excellent genes and will be a good breeding dog. While it was likely that Hong Dong would be used for breeding, Tibetan Mastiffs are also purchased by wealthy people in China as a status symbol. Some of the most prestigious dog breeders can sell their dogs for hundreds of thousands of dollars and won't even let you see the puppies until you tell them how much you have to spend. Number 12. The Ferraris of the Dog World because we all want a dog that can run away from us as fast as possible when we lose control of them, right? Greyhounds are dogs that have long been used for coursing game and racing. These tall, muscular, smooth-coated dogs with tough feet and long tails are incredibly fast and can achieve race speeds of more than 40 miles an hour. Some can even reach a top speed of 43 miles an hour within 100 feet. Sometimes the average car on its last legs won't even go that fast. Greyhounds are gentle, intelligent dogs with a slim build, flexible spine, and long, powerful legs, and they usually stand at about 30 inches tall at the withers and weigh up to 88 pounds. They're born in a wide variety of colors like red, blue, black, fawn, and brindle, and they're generally considered great pets. Now, you might not believe it, but they do love quiet environments where they can become the best couch dog they can be. They're not as hyperactive as they appear to be at the average racetrack, and some would even thrive as apartment dogs since they can sleep for up to 18 hours a day. So they might be the Ferraris of the dog world, but they're also more than happy being your resident couch potato. Number 11. Bergamasco Shepherd if you want to own a dog that has strangers on the street saying, wow, look at that dog, the Bergamasco Shepherd is for you. At first glance, they look like they haven't been brushed for their entire lives, but their beautiful coats are what makes this Italian sheepdog from the Bergamasque Alps and Prealps stand out from the crowd. These solidly built, medium-sized dogs have three hair textures on their bodies that form loose mats or flocks. The flocks are strands of hair woven together to create flat, felted hair layers, and they cover their entire bodies and legs. Legs. These flocks protect the dogs from the icy conditions of the Italian Alps, which is where they were bred for herding sheep and cattle. The Bergamasco Shepherd was first exhibited at a dog show in Milan in 1881, and the very first one was registered in a stud book in 1891. It wasn't until 1949 that a breed association was established, and it was finally recognized as a breed in 1956. But it's not exactly a dog you see every day. Between 2011 and 2019, just 97 of them were registered in Italy each year with a maximum of 149 registrations one year and a minimum of 48 in another. Number 10. Pig, the Unusual Dog Pig is easily one of the most unusual dogs in the world. You can't help but do a double take when you see her owner, Kim Dillenbeck, taking her for walks. Pig looks like she should be a big dog, but she's not. And that's because she has short spine syndrome. This condition often presents in dogs as missing ribs, damaged vertebrae, and incorrectly rotated joints. Kim found Pig and her siblings abandoned in a forest in Atlanta where they had been left to try and make it on their own. So Kim did what any decent human would do. She saved the puppy's lives and adopted Pig to join her family. The name is definitely confusing for a dog who hops around like a frog. Pig has hunched shoulders and her head is fused to her shoulders. As a result, she can't move her head to see what's around her. She also has multiple medical conditions that cause daily challenges, but she's more than living life to the fullest. Pig found her place in the spotlight after attending the Doo Dah Day Festival, and before long, her Facebook page had amassed over 76,000 followers. Many people were curious about her breed, so Kim decided to have a DNA test done. The results were confusing, to say the least. Apparently, Pig is a boxer, chow chow, American Staffordshire Terrier cross. Number 9. Hybrid Dog in Iraq 
Very rarely do you come across a dog that has you scratch in your head. You might not have any idea about a dog's breed, but you can at least be sure that a dog is, well, a dog. Some people weren't so certain when they saw two animals in the Mahu Mountains in the Salah al-Din Governorate in Iraq. Questionable hybrid dogs were reported on in the Al Marsad newspaper after a man saw strange dog and lion-like creatures roaming in the mountains. They appeared to look like lions, but also had the nature of dogs. A number of people had seen them, and there were plenty of opportunities to take photos and video footage. They were tall with dark fur, the faces of lions, but the stature and wagging tails of dogs. It was a confusing sight. What also grabbed many people's attention were the large skin sacks under their jaws. They could either be a natural part of whatever type of animal they are or some kind of growth that requires medical care. But they were described as being abnormal sacks. Abnormal is definitely a word you'd use to describe this entire lion-dog hybrid, to be fair. Number 8. Hercules, the world's largest dog. It's not very often that a dog will weigh more than its owner, but that's certainly the case with Hercules, the English Mastiff from Peabody, Massachusetts, who claimed the Guinness World Record for being the world's largest dog. While Hercules' owner, Mr. J. Flynn, weighs 270 pounds, Hercules is even heavier at 282 pounds. His neck is also an impressive 38 inches. Imagine trying to go collar shopping. While he's huge with a thick neck and paws the size of softballs, Mr. Flynn said he's a gentle giant who wouldn't hurt a fly. Mr. Flynn and his wife, Wendy, brought Hercules home after Wendy wanted a larger dog than the one they already had, an old bull mastiff. They realized he was a large dog, even as a puppy, but had no idea he would grow up to be as large as he was. They also did nothing to encourage his large size, and he eats a regular diet like any other dog. The Flynn's neighbor's son, David Delaro, was browsing through the Guinness Book of World Records when he saw a dog that looked exactly like Hercules. He contacted them, and upon realizing it wasn't Hercules and that dog had actually passed away, Hercules was able to claim the title. Number 7. Quasimodo with a rare spine syndrome. You might be familiar with Pig, the dog with short spine syndrome, but now you're learning about a German Shepherd with the same syndrome. There are only 13 dogs with this condition, and Quasimodo is one of them. Quasi is a sweet dog with a condition that causes all of his organs to be crammed up inside his body due to missing ribs. He also has a crooked spine, missing vertebrae, a shrunken stomach, a corkscrew tail, and one testicle. Now, unfortunately, not a lot is known about Quasi's past because he was found as a stray at four years old and taken to a shelter in Kentucky before making his way to second-hand hounds in Minnesota. Because of the years of neglect he likely faced, Quasi had a collar embedded in his almost non-existent neck, but that hasn't stopped him from being the sweetest, most lovable dog. Second-hand hounds founder Rachel Mayrose said he's a great dog and she was positive they were going to find him a loving home. The plan was for Quasi to receive surgery to neuter him and make him more comfortable before he would be put up for adoption. Number 6. Dog Adopts Deer Isabel Springett found a very young and helpless fawn in a wooded area by her property, but decided not to interfere. She thought the fawn's mother might come back for her. But after three days of hearing the fawn cry, Isabel realized that it wasn't looking likely. So she did what any animal lover would do. She took in the fawn. The only place to put it was on her dog Kate's bed, but she didn't expect Kate to act in the way she did. Kate, who has never had puppies to care for, took on the role of mother right away. She cared for the fawn, now named Pippin, and followed her around making sure she was okay. After two weeks, the fawn decided it wanted to sleep in the forest, and Kate would always be sad as she watched Pippin leave. Although Pippin was never far away, she returned daily, and their friendship blossomed even as the fawn turned into a mature deer. Isabel was so touched by their relationship that she wrote two books about it, called Kate and Pippin, An Unlikely Love Story, and Kate and Pippin's Family, The Unlikely Love Story, continues. Number 5. Puppy with a Heart Marking Puppies are born with all kinds of weird and wonderful colors and patterns. Splotches, blotches, spots, you name it, they have it. But very rarely do you encounter animals with splotches, blotches, and spots that resemble actual real-world objects. Although some have actually been born with fur in the shape of hearts, and it's downright adorable. A Jack Russell cross called Valerie was born into a household in Newcastle under Lyme, Staffordshire. Her owners, Joanne and Dave Boardman, said the marking was so distinctive that you couldn't miss it. Joanne said she had never seen anything like it before. The pair already had a poodle, British bulldog, Great Dane, Jack Russell, and three Jack Russell puppies before Valerie came along, but they didn't think they could keep her based on the number of animals they already owned. Their pet food bill comes to a grand 
total of 120 pounds each month. Joanne's daughter was eager to keep the puppy, but she couldn't see her being able to convince her dad, although she was happy knowing that whenever they sell puppies, the owners usually keep in touch and often come back for more puppies. She also said they always make sure they go to good homes. Number 4. Six-Legged Puppy in early 2021, Skipper, the Border Collie Australian Shepherd, became the first canine in history to survive being born with six legs. Along with six legs, the 11-ounce puppy had two tails, two pelvic regions, two reproductive systems, and two lower urinary tracts. According to vets, the unique puppy has four back legs and two front limbs, and her unique makeup is due to congenital conjoining disorders. Neil Veterinary Hospital vet Dr. Everett said they believe the dog is one of a kind, and they don't think they'll ever see another other puppy like it in their lifetime. While no other canine like Skipper is known to survive out of the womb, Skipper thrived almost immediately. Her organs were in good shape and she was peeing and pooping as any dog should, although she does have two anuses. Her outcome isn't known, but vets believe there's a chance she might have a shorter life expectancy than the average dog. They think she will need assistance with mobility and physical therapy as she ages. The last update we could find about Skipper was at three months old and there was hope for her to be able to move around like an average dog with regular physical therapy. Number 3. One-Eyed Dog when some Jai Fumaman from Thailand was getting ready for work in 2020, he noticed that his dog was sitting on his bed with two puppies. It wasn't until he placed them in a basket to keep them warm when he realized that one didn't look like a typical puppy. It only had one eye, large lips, and a strange piece of skin on its forehead. He and his wife Amphan called the puppy Kevin after the Minions character of the same name, and they posted pictures of their unique new family edition online. As the puppy was unable to feed like his sibling, his owner's bottle fed him and said he appeared to be fit and healthy despite having only one eye. The puppy was immediately a big hit with locals who flocked to see him. Many even offered to take over ownership, but Somjai and Amphan were keen to keep Kevin and give him the best chance of survival. I've been trying to find an update to see whether Kevin's still alive and well, but there doesn't appear to be one. Number 2. Two-Headed Dog the birth of any puppy is an exciting occasion, but it was probably more surprising than exciting for the Wangal Ortiz family in Bagua, Peru. Six Creole breed dogs were born into the Wangal Ortiz family, but one wasn't like its siblings. Instead, it had two heads. On the two heads, you can see a pair of noses and mouths and four eyes, with two being close together. Surprisingly, the puppy had been born alive. The family reassured everyone who heard about the puppy's birth that they would be treating it just like its siblings and would also be consulting vets to find out if it needed any special care or food. It's unknown whether the puppy would survive, but animals born with two heads don't typically live very long. The condition is known as polycephaly, and it happens when an egg hasn't separated properly after being fertilized. Number 1. Dog Walks on Hind Legs Dogs can't help but capture your attention and make you smile when you see them being walked along residential streets. But if you happen to be in Ure, Colorado, there's one that'll capture your attention more than others, and that's the Britney Spaniel called Dexter. Dexter is known all around town and now worldwide for walking on two legs. He can even run on two legs and prefers it as his primary way of getting around. In 2016, not long after Kenti Pasek and her family got Dexter, he escaped from their property and went sniffing for deer before having his front legs run over by a truck. The family had previously lost two dogs in two years, and they didn't want to go through the trauma again. Fortunately, vets were sure that they wouldn't have to. They amputated one of his front legs and put pins in the other. It took a few surgeries and rehabilitation, but Dexter was on the road to recovery. Although, instead of walking around on three legs, Dexter decided to use his hind legs to get around since they were his strongest. He has incredible balance and now has an online presence for his daily antics, including on Instagram and TikTok. His videos were even even featured on Late Night with Jimmy Fallon. I hope you didn't make your dog experience these rare dog stories with you. They'd be heartbroken to learn that they're not the most special pupper in the world. Which story shocked you the most, and is there something about your furry friend that makes them unique? Tell us about your dog in the comments. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on screen right now. See you next time!